Hey guys, so it's been a while since I've updated. Um, since then, I've graduated. Yay! And, um, a lot has happened actually. Um, I went on vacation for a week and then, well, it was to my hometown. See everybody graduate. And then I just spent some time there, which was much needed. And then I have had strat for two weeks. Um, technically, I still have it. And I'm taking antibiotics, but you wouldn't be able to tell. Um, I guess it's still in my system. But it wouldn't have been so long if I would have taken my medicine correctly and um, <laughs> not relapsed like I did. Um, the night before, let's see, I don't know, when was it, a Friday, that Friday, last Friday, I woke up with a 104.1 fever, which is kind of not good, and I pretty much had a fever all weekend, until about, seven o'clock on Sunday, I guess. It was so terrible. I felt awful. And, um, but a few days before, I got terribly, awfully sick. Um, it was my and Jesse's six month anniversary, which is kind of exciting. That marks half a year, people. If you don't know how to count, just check in. You know, you might not know, so I just had to inform you. Oh, why do I ramble? Anyway, um, Jesse and I haven't gotten to talk very much since all of this commotion has gone on with graduation and being sick and being everywhere. And then his schedule just doesn't go. So, um, yeah, it really made me mad though the other day when I was extremely sick over the weekend and um, I got online for a few minutes just to find that I was tagged in about three or four pictures. Well, they were of my boyfriend and the girl who I've talked about on a couple of other videos um, was Skyping him, which is fine, but it's the captions that were on those pictures that bothered me. And you know what? It's not, I don't even think it's jealousy that, you know, is wrong with me at this point. It's just the fact that it's annoying. Just stop already with your ridiculousness. You, it's, oh, it's just idiotic. <laughs> Because, um, she put on one picture that he had the cutest smile ever, and then on the other she put hearts. Well, I mean, they were good pictures on them, and I'm glad she tagged me in them, but I know why she did it. She did it so I could read the captions and get mad. Um, on one of the pictures... See, I miss him a lot because I haven't been able to talk to him, and I missed him then. And, you know, <coughs> I just, like, it was really funny, though, before I say that. When I was running fever, my mom was taking care of me. Um, I was crying like crazy. And it wasn't even because I felt so sick. It was because I was upset that. I don't have my boyfriend home to take care of me when all these girls are always talking about how their boyfriend brings them soup and, and teddy bears and, and, you know, takes care of them. And I'm just like, oh, my boyfriend's in Okinawa. This sucks. <laughs> so, anyway, anyway, I post a comment on one of the pictures that said, you know, I missed him a lot and I've been sick all weekend so I haven't been able to talk to him. And her comment back to me was, I just tried to get um, the pictures where he looked the cutest. What? Does that have anything to do with what I just said? Are you, look, 
you know, just based on that comment, that she's trying to take me off. I was like, whatever. So, I got over that after I told Jesse, and he actually agreed with me for once that she was being inappropriate, which made me happy because he never does that. He never seems to see what she's doing or ever catch her doing something wrong, which bugs me till now. Anyway, um, so yeah, that's what's up with that. Um, the guy that's living with us, <laughs> well, that's been interesting, I guess. We get along for the most part, but um, we do have our differences, as most teenagers who are the same exact age might. It's like we're siblings. So, um, him and my brother don't really get along well at all, so we have to pretty much keep them separated. It's, it's great. Um, he did get a job, though, at Subway, which I'm jealous of. I need a job, but I've been sick and busy, so I haven't been able to turn in any applications. I maybe don't want a job at Subway, but somewhere different. <laughs> um, I'm just like... Oh, I miss my boyfriend. He, I don't know what the deal is. I just checked Facebook to see if he was online, but this past week, or his past week, it started our Sunday. He really hasn't been online um, around this time, which he normally is. Um, right now it's 9.54. Well, he gets on about 9.25 or so, which is his lunch hour in Okinawa, and he hasn't been getting on. I don't know why. I did talk to him yesterday for about a minute, and then he had to go, but uh, I don't know. I miss him a lot, and I just want to see him and be with him. It's nerve-wracking not knowing when exactly he's going to be coming home. And it's summertime, and all the couples everywhere. It's sometimes hard, but I'm really, really lucky because I have an amazing support group of friends. I've made friends with so many military girlfriends, fiancés, etc., etc., online, and you know, without them and these videos I, I don't even know where I'd be at all I mean I'd, be, I'd completely lose it every single day I'm sure and everybody's always saying how strong I am well I do have my bad days a long distance relationship isn't easy and on top of that he's a marine and he's in a different country. <laughs> There's a lot that I do worry about. Um, Japan's safe, but you guys know that he got bit by that spider. So, I mean, it doesn't matter where you are. Things can happen. When you're not with me, I worry. <laughs> um, yeah. So, that's what's happening in my life. I don't think I missed anything. I hope you girls and guys, because I do have some guy subscribers, are doing well. Um, I hope you're enjoying summer. Those of you that have time off or in college and school, etc. And um, I'll talk to you guys soon.